Dímelo, dímelo, Bo Dominican York. What's going on, everybody? What's going on? Happy Saturday. Uh, I hope you guys had a great start to the weekend. Um, this is the I Got Next Dunk. This just dropped on the Nike app. And it's an interesting dunk. Uh, I'm pretty sure most of you passed. But... I scooped them up on Foot Locker. They were just sitting, and they're probably still sitting. Uh, they might almost be gone, but I think the sizes are starting to sell out. But again, this is the I Got Next um, dunk. Let's go ahead and start at the bottom. Uh, just like your standard dunk, you're going to have those muted stars at the front. It is your standard dunk bottom, uh, which is exactly like a Jordan 1 bottom. This is a clear outsole, so it it is gonna get yellowed out. It is not, well, I guess it is blue. I guess it is icy blue, but I still feel like it's gonna get yellowed out. Uh, you start out with this uh, toe strap that's got this uh, shiny overlay on it, and then this mint green. I do see a little bit of a widow's peak do see some gunk right there so already I'm gonna expect uh, under black light a lot of gluage but uh I don't know why but I, I I I dug this sneaker when I saw the picture I felt like I'm gonna be able to rock it with some fits that really bring it together if that makes sense uh I wish they came with extra laces I don't think they did I know this one didn't did they? Nope. No extra laces at all. I got next. I don't know what's behind the story. These were 125 bucks, and they just released on the 6th. But um, last sale on StockX was 140 bucks in a size 9, which I ended up buying a size 9 to get that snug fit. Uh, I've got some dunk highs in a 9.5 and, and 9, and I do like the 9 snugness. But I could still wear the nine and a half. The nine and a halves are super comfortable. Let's take a look at that size tag. Oh, sorry, let's take a look at this first. Fidelity is decent. You can kind of see some waviness going on. Made in Vietnam. And why we love them so much. Nike Air or Nike on the tongue. you my friend production should have been this year I believe so I bought these in my natural size of nine uh, I bought these a half size down in my natural size so I bought them in a size nine uh, production ran from 1221 through 122 very short run in Vietnam good stitching belty footbed but good stitching. Uh, interesting. This insole. That is pretty sweet. Uh, it fades from a dark uh, or a black to a blue. And you've got a picture of a basketball rim and I got next. An outdoor hoop and I got next with the Nike swoosh. Is it the same on the other shoe? Yes, I got next. Identical. But this is a really good looking shoe. Um, I think this is a summer, a summer, a summer wear for me. Uh, that's what really stood out to me that this uh, is such a vibrant, uh, cool color. I wonder what they do under black light. Maybe nothing. Let's take a look. Ah, uh, been kind of relaxed. I've, I've had half a cup of coffee this morning, so I'm not I'm not 100% on yet. So uh, I apologize if I'm just kind of laid back and you guys want more energy. But there you go, some gluage uh, where the shoe meets the midsole. Come on, Vietnam. Just kidding. But um, decent shoe. It's not a lot of... Uh, Stains everywhere. This is not a glow-in-the-dark bottom. 
I love how those laces reflect back. I love how the uh, Virgil Abloh book glows. <sighs> that thing is nice. But pretty clean shoe, construction, not bad at all. Uh, I did expect a little bit more in terms of overspill or, or things of that nature, but no, did not have that. Um, so I really wanted you guys to see it uh, in my hands to kind of figure out if this is something that you might even want to cop because they're going to be still going super cheap uh, on the resale market. Again, this is the Nike Dunk High Copa Game Royal. I got these in a size 9 and made in Vietnam. Just your standard Nike box. The old orange box. There is a stamp. Two, 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 two. I got an answer machine that'll talk to you. Hey, how you doing? Sorry you can't get through. Why don't you leave your name and your number and I'll get back to you. Uh, anyway, some old De La Soul, some old hip hop. Uh, yeah, I've been into everything. I like it all, man. I like most of it. If it's good music, I like it. If it's not good music, which is subjective, uh, it's not much that I consider bad music. Um, but I don't know. That's, that's, it's another channel. Or we could have the disco. Uh, I should, I kind of want to go live one day, guys. I kind of want to go live one day. Hey, so again, this is the I Got Next Nike Dunk High. Uh, I want to quick give a quick shout out to uh, Uncivilized Clothing. Uh, that is a Fulmer Simpson and his brother uh, brand. And I just bought a camo trucker hat. And I'm, I'm really digging this thing, man. You guys need to check them out. I love watching Fulmer Simpson and as well as all the uh, shoe YouTubers. But um, Fulmer's one, one of my top three. Uh, definitely Unbreakable, Fulmer Simpson, DNA show. Uh, probably in my top three. But I do watch a lot of Mike Rich. I watch a lot of Mike Rich. Uh, he's just hilarious. Uh, fun to watch. A lot of content. A lot of videos. So I watch stuff. Going back the whole five years or, or whatever. Um, but anyway, uncivilized, really good trucker hat, inexpensive. Uh, to have something different that no, not a lot of people are going to have, right? Uh, very similar to a lot of other trucker style hats. But I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. Uh, this is a pretty quick one. Uh, again, the Nike Dunk High Men's I Got Next. Uh, silly colorway or... Yeah, silly colorway, but I think will pop. Definitely giving Miami vibes or summer vibes. Again, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. You can hit me up on Instagram at Rivera.bo. Uh, I've got more content coming probably today as well. I've got the Reimagines, uh, a UA pair of the Reimagines, and I do want to film those today. So anyway, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. Uh, it's your Uncle Bo. Que Dios te bendiga. Peace.